About every parent's been there, done that. Your kid forgets homework or sports gear for practice, so you leave work and rush it to them. And that's what a state cop did, but it got him fired. News 13 Selena Westervelt is live in the Newsplex with that story. Diane, William Cunningham was not only fired, he was banned from being a cop for a year and a half. Now he's suing. A teenage daughter calls her dad. She's missing an important piece of equipment for her soccer game. Her shin guards, so she asks dad to bring them to her. Dad, state police officer William Cunningham, leaves his patrol beat in Santa Fe and heads to the soccer complex in Bernalillo. Court documents show Cunningham called dispatch first and told them he was going to veer off his beat. Documents show officers are allowed to do that from time to time, but only with a supervisor's permission. Cunningham says there wasn't a supervisor on duty that fall day in 2010, and because he left his route, he was suspended, then fired. His law enforcement license stripped for a year and a half. This guy is absolutely being treated unfairly. His lawyer, Sam Brigman, says Cunningham's being targeted because his supervisors didn't like him. He says it's unfair state cops charged with felonies like David Sherman, who was arrested this weekend for aggravated DWI, are suspended with pay while his client was fired. For seeing um, the state police, particularly the law enforcement academy board, uh, not really using common sense. Um, they're just, they're doing things that are out of control, quite frankly, and it's too bad. Now, William Cunningham was off his normal beat for an hour and 20 minutes. Cunningham is suing to be recertified early by the state and considering suing for money later. Diane? All right, thank you, Selena. Cunningham is now working for the police department in Cuba, but he can't be a full-fledged cop or carry a gun until he is recertified by the state. All right here.